The 65th Commonwealth Parliamentary Conference in Halifax kicked off with a call on Commonwealth parliamentarians to embrace inclusive parliamentary democracy. The vice patron of the Commonwealth Parliamentary Association, Honorable Mary Simon, the Governor General of Canada, encouraged the parliamentarians to ensure that deliberations take cognizance of democratic principles and the values of the Commonwealth. Speaker of the House of Commons of Canada and host of the CPA, Honorable Anthony Rota emphasized the value of inclusion, accessibility and accountability for all parliamentarians as they deliberate on various issues from responses to COVID-19 to building gender-sensitive legislatures and addressing issues around climate change. The Speaker of the House of Representatives of Nigeria, Honorable Femi Bajabi Amila, says the Nigerian delegation will take advantage of the networking opportunities with other parliamentarians, noting that lessons learned at the conference will add value to democratic principles in Nigeria. Well, moments such as this afford us an opportunity for us to come together, to dialogue, to compare notes. We look at things like gender, equity, youth development, um, good governance and particularly the role of parliamentarians in, in politics, in international uh, development, in governance, uh, which cannot be overstated. Nigeria has 36 states and this particular Commonwealth Parliamentary Association involves all the states. So we have, um, we have a, a handful from the National Assembly. Um, but the rest of it are from different states um, throughout the Federation. Um, that, that makes up the number uh, that represent Nigeria. The theme of the 65th CPC is inclusive, accessible, accountable and strong parliaments, the cornerstone of democracy and essential for development. I'm Joy Luciago. Reporting from the Halifax Convention Center.